Okay, so I just got back from um, seeing the Star, the Last Jedi, and um, to answer the question of uh, was it better than the Force Awakens? A resounding yes. Um, it had so many twists and turns and things that I did not really expect to happen. Um, and I was so genuinely surprised uh, at the work that Rian put in to making this film um, everything that it was. It's uh, the cinematography is great, the, uh, acting is superb, um, the sound design, as I've always said, sound design and Star Wars go hand in hand, um, the special effects are top notch, absolute, like, 100% top gear, um, uh, and it just, it was just an amazing film, um, overall. Um, now I did, uh, there were a couple things that I was a little bit more disappointed in, um, that, the like, like, um, not things that I was, like, hugely disappointed in, uh, just some stuff that I just thought they, uh, should have done, uh, differently, um, one of these things being that, uh, it, that, um, they didn't go the same route that I thought they were going to take, um, which is okay, uh, for the most part, um, but I thought they were going to go one way and they ended up going a different way, and that's fine, it's nice to have some twists and turns, uh, but it did kind of disappoint me, um, obviously this is a spoiler free review and it's, I'm literally filming this in my car right now, uh, right outside the movie theater um but yeah so uh what uh I would definitely give this movie a solid five Boba Fett out of five it was amazing and uh yeah <laughs> I can't even say any more about it go out watch it it's worth the money um and yeah, that is, that's all I have to say about it. So, thank you for watching this little mini review. And, uh, uh, if you enjoyed it, please give it a like. It does help out a lot. Tell from the day about my Star Wars channel. It's pretty awesome. And may the Force be with you. And stay tuned for the dramatic reviews that are going to come up.